Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new here, my name is Melissa. I am a Pisces, um, also known as Green Eye Phoenix Goddess here on YouTube and Instagram and Facebook as well. So guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much. I think you'll find that as a Pisces with a lot of different placements in my chart, I love to do all kinds of different things, but anything, again, pertaining to my channel will always be linked down below. Feel free to book with me if something resonates, if you like my energy, if my energy vibes with yours, please feel free to book. I always have different specials going on, so please make sure you follow on all kinds of media platforms. That way you don't miss out on anything. Um, again, these are always very general, guys, so don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. It helps me out. And yeah, with all that being said, you guys, again, know how much I love and appreciate you. I hope that these resonate with you guys. And Let's get right into the videos. I love you guys. Mwah. Hey, Gemini. We're going to do your bonus birthday weekend reading. Um, and because I, I literally just did a love reading for you guys, right? And I kept getting the message was all about like self-care for the month of June. So I figured I'm just going to pull some, um, some life oracle cards, basically, like just overall. And just see exactly what it is that you guys can be focusing on as far as self-care that can help you through this time with a lot of you going through, you know, could be possible breakups, just heartbreak, stuff like that, okay? So for my Gemini's bonus birthday reading, what do my Gemini's need to be doing as far as self-care, taking care of themselves, things that they should be focusing on in their lives right now for all my Gemini's who are watching now and all my Gemini's who are watching later. Thank you. The colors you wear, yeah. So like Gemini, for example, like if you if you wake up one day and you feel like a little cranky and irritated or you don't feel as joyful, use color magic. You know what I mean? Like, and I don't mean like actual magic. I just mean like, like associating yellow with happiness. Maybe wear yellow, right? It, it's gonna, you'll notice it'll change like your mood. Like it does work because it's all, it's all psychological. It's all mental as well. It's all energy, okay? Essential oils would be beneficial for you guys. Um, it boosts your mood and promotes positive energy because I'm getting you guys are in the energy of doing this self-care and getting over stuff, right? Like trying to learn things in your lives. Um, you're trying to really, just really come out of like dark places and really trying to make positive choices for yourself, right? You're trying to get positive energy and essential oils can do that for you. Yeah, see, look, awaken your dormant potential and unlock your inner wish. What was I saying about using color magic, right? Oh my God, I cannot, you see? See, I just love how massive just comes together. All right, meditating, getting outdoors, which you guys really are outdoorsy. Like, a lot of you do like to be outdoors, but it's almost like if you don't have anybody to really, like, chill with, you don't want to do it all by yourself sometimes, you know? So it just says never get so busy that you forget to enjoy the outdoors. What else for my Geminis? What else can they be focusing on during this time? Which would make sense when the, you know, it's funny because, anyway leveling up right start small start today just start the sky's the limit for those of you who have been thinking about doing like a side hustle okay forgiveness is for you forgive others and yourself because your soul deserves peace right those of you who are trying to hold on to a grudge okay experience the magic of life you must first practice it right practicing your positive affirmations practicing trying to actually change things right and third eye is out of bounds which doesn't it doesn't surprise me because of the fact that you have a lot of self-healing to do and you have a lot on your mind take a vacation take time to escape all your life obligations to recharge yourself all right i'm gonna pull from my other self-care deck as well which i love i absolutely love this deck so let's see what else for my gemini's what other self-care can they be doing during this time don't move stop stay there okay what other self-care for my Geminis? What other self-care can they be doing during this time? And happy birthday again, Geminis. Happy birthday season. Sweet treat. Making a meal. Yeah, you guys. Okay, so yeah. I just heard like eating out too much. Some of you have been eating out too much. What else? What else can my Geminis be doing? What self-care? energy work <laughs> um and i'm gonna hold on because i gotta close this out i'm gonna leave it like this hold on which i'm laughing because 
energy work goes all together with what I pulled for you guys already with meditate, awakening the witch, right? The colors you wear, the getting outdoors ritual, the third eye being out of le like leveling up, like sweet, like it all kind of coincides together of the self care that you guys really need to be doing for yourself. You have to be trusting your energy, trusting your intuition, right? Working on, again, getting yourself to a place where you can really overlook the things that you feel you need to change about yourself and not be upset with yourself about it, you know? Just accept, embrace, and change, and then move forward, and that's it, right? So, I hope you guys have the best birthday. If your birthday was this week or this weekend, I hope you guys have an amazing birthday. Um, yeah, I am really excited for this for you guys. I really am. You guys, once you do your self-care, you'll be good to go, all right? So, thank you guys so much. I hope that you enjoy this. Um, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.